Hey everyone, this is Jenny Garcia and in this video I'm going to unbox the Studio Calico kit of May. And to be honest, this month I struggle, uh, you know, deciding whether or not I was going to skip the kit. I did decide to uh, keep it, to still get it, and I hope I don't regret it and I'll tell you why as I, what were the items that made me decide because I usually don't look too much. I like to be a little surprised and I easily forget, but this one I looked at it so many times that I kind of know exactly what's in here. I did get, and this is one of the reasons I got the kit, so I could have a little add-on, which was this washi tape from the Traveler's Notebook, and I am obsessed with it. I just love anything that looks like paper, feels like paper, and this is just too cute to pass. So this was a major reason why I wanted to keep the kit. Let's see. You're really stuck in there, aren't you? Okay. Now, the labels... In the website, this look a little lighter, and I like them a little bit more. I'm not talking about the the red or blue. I do like that shade of red and blue. What's inside that yellowy color? I like, again, that it's very throwback to when you go to school and you get that paper that would, like, shred into a million pieces if you try to erase a little. So uh, that's a core memory. I don't know if it's dramatic. <laughs> just a childhood thing um mixed feelings about it love the pattern not sure about the color like that it has two sheets it's always a plus so we'll see these letters i could have sworn they they were bigger and there is only 26 of these so i see two a's uh hopefully we get a few e's the colors are okay. Honestly, I don't think there's 26 in here. I'm guessing that there must be more. But, or maybe they, they, I'm not sure what they meant, but quite a few of them. I like those. I like the letters. Uh, I thought they were going to be bigger, but I actually am okay with this size too. I think the bigger would have made it a little bit more interesting, but it works. Washi tape, you know that I cannot say no to washi tape. So this is an, this was another reason why I decided to get the kit. It looks like fabric. It's really cute. The tags were uh, yes. My decisions so the letters were a yes but i was also concerned about the number so the tags are a yes in every little sense of the word of the word you know i like the size i like the colors i like everything they're not double-sided so don't mind it i'm pretty sure i'm going to use them on top of cards oh they're really thick just like the cards are so they have three six nine twelve so we have twelve and we have blue um we have blue yellow green and green yeah love these the stamp set i think the stamp set was pretty cool this is a lot smaller than i would like especially because Lately, their um, the quality is not as great. The indentation is not as deep. I do love this label stamp, and I like the possibility of putting this inside of here. I think it's a great design. It says, this is very important to me. Try something new today. Our adventure begins right here. Glad I capture every minute of it. I want to remember every bit of this in the greatest adventure of all time. I like those sentiments. They're pretty good. I think it's a good stamp set. I want to see how those very little um, sentiments stamp. 
I'll leave the cards at the end. This is always a plus. Uh, they could have been cuter. I don't really celebrate Cinco de Mayo. Um, happy Mother's Day and Spring 5. It's okay. Not in my top. Now this was one definite yes. So this one's I love. And I'm going to say from now, this is my favorite item in the whole kit. It's a month where it's way too easy to say which item was my favorite. And I'm not sure that I love that. I love a month where everything is so cute that I'm like, oh, it's so hard. I can't pick. So let's open the cards to look at them. Now, these, this, the swans are giving major Maggie Holmes vibes. And I'm not sure I feel great about that. Uh, Maggie does pretty cute stuff, but I, I don't know how to add ducks and stuff like that to my to my album. The colors are dark. This one is kind of cute. I like this blue. This I like the design. Not a big fan of the off white. journey of a thousand miles must begin with a single step i like that quote but it's so small and it, the color is like so faded i don't even know if you're gonna get to see it on camera good quote i wish it was it was big and bold i don't know why they made that decision okay on cook noodles my favorite adventure soloing with you. The word to wonder guide. I like this, but in the photos it looked like more purplish. I don't know if it's how it photographs. Uh, I don't know. Not, not if, none of the cards really jump at me that much. And there's a white one. Okay. Even the signature, um, way to grow. I like the design. It's okay. Not a fan of this. This one I love. New Adventures Head. And I wish they would have done more of this sort of space theme. And this like umber and fading. That would have been cute. Look, explore, and discover. More ducks, I mean, swans. I like this. I wish the color was different. I like this, though. Here's to my fresh start. I want to remember every bit of this. The greatest adventure of all time. And glad I capture every minute of it. This is an odd design. Um, hmm. So, breathe in the fresh air. Knowing what I know now, and looking at the kit, when I bought it again, I'm going to go with no. I think the photographs did a better job than the kit did. It's kind of cute. I like this. Oh, this is the card maybe that I was thinking about. You see, they would have used more of this color scheme like more purple more of this I really like this this I love schools out favorite things about this past year what I'm looking forward to next uh, away we go and I like this color too and the pattern very simple so let me see out of what I got and I'm not gonna count this because I this is an add-on uh, the cards, if I were to like have the chance to buy these on their own, I would not get the cards. I think that liking five, it's not, I don't know. Uh, this is meh. Uh, the stamp set, I got a stamp. 
because otherwise if it stamps decently then cool worth it these you know what these are growing on me they kind of look like the ones that you have to like put paste on the back okay this i would definitely get and so what i the the tags the washi is really cute would it be my first choice of washi no the letters i want to see how e's i have <laughs> if i have three e's at least then maybe i like some of these colors too like this blue and this purple that's pretty nice wait i haven't even seen any e's I have two E's. Meh. I think that the only two items that I love from the kit were the tags and these asterisk stickers. Uh, not my favorite kit. It, the, so far in the year, they've, they've been pretty solid. They had a few, like the April one and the February kit. Those were... Out of the park, super gorgeous. Uh, January was super cute. And March was cute. Again, not, not my favorite one, but it was still really pretty and I like most of the items. This is... I wish I, I, I skipped it. <laughs> but hey, I got it. So maybe I'll pay more attention from now on because I did look at it many, many times. But I think that... It was going to be one of those cases when the products were going to be a lot prettier in person and I didn't want to miss out on the washi and these items. But we'll see. We'll see if I can make something for um, from it. Let me know what you think. Don't let my negative uh, Nelly <laughs> rub on you. If these are the colors that you like, if you spend every crafty moment documenting swans, maybe this is the kit for you. Maybe that's what I need to do. Uh, anyway, thank you so much for watching, and I hope you guys have an awesome day. Bye!